On a cruise ship security scare at Port Miami, the Norwegian Sky is finally on its way to the Bahamas, but not before an hours long delay. CBS 4's Donna Rapato joins us live from Port Miami. What happened, Donna? Well, Rick, that's right. The ship finally just left about 25 minutes ago, more than five hours after it was supposed to set sail for the Bahamas. And here's what we know happened. Uh, just after noon today, ship security said a passenger successfully made it through the security checkpoints here in the main terminal, but that got on the ship without the assigned key card, which is essentially your boarding pass. As 2,200 people were about to head on a three-day vacation to the Bahamas, security aboard the Norwegian Sky reported a breach just after noon Friday. 700 passengers already on board and the other 1,500 or so still arriving were held inside this terminal for up to seven hours. They're not telling anybody anything. Yeah, there is a lot of uproar right now. Some passengers were frustrated, others downright irate, jammed inside the terminal, fed sandwiches and water, cell phones dying. Officers in protective gear and their canines swept the ship repeatedly, looking for a possible violator. Meanwhile, some passengers chose not to wait, no longer feeling safe. It's supposed to be freestyle cruising, and no one is really at peace at this point. And still others felt these days better safe than sorry. It's an inconvenience to everybody. But again, it's got to be done. You know, we got to find out. We got to make sure nothing is bad. After giving the all clear, investigators shed some light on why passengers got so few details as they waited. And unfortunately, the information that we broadcast in there to passengers, that information will immediately get tweeted out on their phones. That information will go worldwide. And then, of course, there's limited information. So that, again, works against us. And we're back out live. Investigators finally determining everyone on the ship's manifest was accounted for. So no breach after all. Norwegian Cruise Line reps tell me that each stateroom did receive a $50 credit to use on the ship within the three-day cruise. As for refunds for the people who left because they didn't feel safe, I asked repeatedly and they did not answer. We're live at Port Miami. Donna Rapato, CBS 4 News tonight.